Hi all, a quick video on getting wind for Yesu controlling your radio and still being able to uh, use programs like WSJTX or uh, Winlink or any uh, other software while that COM port is in use by wind for Yesu First thing I need to do is download the uh, virtual COM port driver it's on page 18 of the manual it shows you which one you want with the with the 64-bit or 32-bit just download the uh, appropriate one I've already uh, downloaded it so we extract all they just extract it in its standard spots so now it's extracted if you open up you'll now see setup just run setup wait for us to do its uh, install you may have not have seen that uh, screen there where it's just asking me to do you want to allow the uh, software to change stuff on your computer it's the normal windows stuff so just follow the, the prompts the next I agree next I'll let it install in its default locations and it says it's completed click next and click finish so now we just need to run it close that win for Yesu down okay once you've installed it if you go into your start button and the com zero com if you left click on setup it's, if it's black screen I'm not sure it's recording it or not but it's just allow the software to change your uh, computer now on this screen here you see in this top boxes here we can put in say a com pair of com 30 and 31 apply and if you go to your uh, device manager you'll see up here is a pair 30 and 31 that's all we need to do with that so if you now run win for Yesu suite this this has already been set up to uh, run on my radio so under tools settings you'll see the the actual radio is on com3 and it's connected and the third party software hardware on the auxiliary cat port 1 if we just put in there the com30 the first one in your your uh, two boxes press connect and now that's connected so now if we uh, can save that minimize that now if you run your WSJTX we've got two because for the two radios and once it runs we're going to get a uh, error because it's looking for the radio on COM3 so if you go OK come and need to change it change that to COM31 everything else is the same just OK it and OK the pre-release and that's your uh, Whisper or WSJTX running alongside of your uh, win for Yesu. So, for instance, we change bands to say to 20 meters. You can see it's changed here, changed on here, and you've taken my word for it, but it's also changed the radio. So, just a quick overview and the settings now. The radio is COM31, and on here, under the settings, we've got COM30 and the radio is still COM3 so that's very very quick outline so if you want to do that for uh, all the other software uh, Win Winlink for instance you do the same you just change the radio serial port to 
the uh, port in the second window and it gets in the second one here and a little bit of activity again tonight by the looks on 20 meters so it's uh, a bit rough and ready but hopefully gives you a bit of a, a clue on how to get things started with comport emulation so you can run win for Yesu alongside in this case WSJTX that works the same for all other software all the audio settings are the same still your uh, USB codex it's just that COM port on the radio uh, tab thank you